Want to know what 50 meters of bubble wrap looks like? There you go. It's a bunch. Please um, buy some beard oil and help us get through this thing. Matthew, you legend. Your order came in pretty much as I just said that. And I've decided it must be fate. I'm not going to mention your name lest the data protection police come for me in the night. <laughs> but so you know you're the Matthew. Put this little smiley face on the box for you. Okay, I decided that was a pretty crap <laughs> signal, so I've thrown in a brush and comb on us, mate. Thank you very much. Good afternoon, you bearded beauties. It's Alex from MissionBeard.com. When it comes to limited, crowded video shoot locations and beard care, there are a few more informed than us. We're not going to talk about the former, <laughs> but by golly, will we talk about beards. Today, we're going to answer a question that I ummed and art about for a long time when I first started growing a beard, and the location, my ensuite, is a clue. The question is, do you need beard shampoo? Now, there's a long answer and a short answer to this question. And the short answer is, it depends. The slightly longer answer is, it depends on how long your beard is and how it's feeling. If you've got a short beard, just a little bit longer than stubble, maybe, maybe like half the length of what we've got here, sort of uh, like a centimeter in length, and it smells fine, it isn't too scratchy or itchy, then the answer is, as long as you're keeping it clean with just regular water, you probably aren't going to need beard shampoo just yet. However, if it's starting to get a bit longer, it's starting to maybe smell or feel like unnecessarily oily when you run your fingers through it, or it's starting to get a bit itchy, then the answer is, you could probably do with a little bit of beard shampoo. Why do you need beard shampoo? And why can't you just use regular shampoo? Well, the skin on your scalp and the skin on your face are very, very different things. Up here, it can take a bit of a beating from all of the nasty sounding ingredients that you get in common commercial shampoo. However, your face is a much, much gentler creature and if you use regular shampoo on it for a while, it's gonna start to kick off big time. The tricky thing with this is that when you start to get itching from regular shampoo, you might just think that your beard itch is getting worse because it, it will make it worse. <laughs> This stuff really isn't meant to be used on broken skin. So, when that itching starts to step up a gear, in all likelihood, you're gonna think you're not using enough shampoo and you're gonna double down. You guessed it, your itching is gonna get even worse. It's a vicious cycle. A good beard shampoo, on the other hand, is formulated with much, much nicer ingredients that are far kinder on your skin. The right product will use all natural ingredients and will be free from things like parabens and sulfates and surfactants that can be a little bit tough on your skin. Do we sell beard shampoo? No, well, not as of this video being shot, but be sure to check back on the website. Do we have one that we'd recommend? Absolutely we do. Seven Potions do an absolutely brilliant job. These guys have been around for years and their products are probably some of the best that I've found in the UK for the price and they've recently branched out to the US as well, so you can pick these up on, on Amazon. We'll try and put a link in the description as soon as YouTube figures out that I'm not a robot or a Russian spy. <laughs> this particular product I've got here is the Woodland Harmony, which has uh, cedarwood and sandwood oil in, as well as some other natural fragrances that I'm not sure they're gonna tell us, because otherwise people would try and copy it. On top of that, they have ingredients like aloe vera, which uh, is going to further hydrate your beard and leave it feeling soft. How often should you use beard shampoo? Well, again, the long answer and short answer, it depends. If you have a job where you're behind a desk and you potentially are pretty sedentary and don't exercise much, then, you know, twice a week is probably going to get the job done. However, if you have a manual job where you're working with your hands or you're busting your ass in the gym four, five, six days a week, you're probably going to need to step that up a little bit. For a rule of thumb, with a beard of my size, I wash this pretty much every day. To be fair, I'm in the gym Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, and I do a bit of jujitsu and stuff in the evening, so if I don't, it would start to get pretty nasty pretty quickly. However, I reckon a good rule of thumb to start with, if you're not sure, is twice a week. If you use a good beard shampoo, like this one by Seven Potions that we mentioned before, then using it too much isn't gonna cause too much of a problem because there won't be ingredients in it that are gonna irritate your skin. 
use the cheaper one. We're talking the ones on Amazon that are maybe like eight pounds or like $10 or under, then you might start to run into some issues. So start with twice a week. If you feel it's a little bit too much, you can step it back. If you feel that your beard is starting to get a bit too oily, maybe you're finding stuff in it, ugh, then you can always you can always step it up a little bit. If you've got a bit of extra cash to splash around and you want to take your beard care to the next level, they also do a beard conditioner, which is brilliant. It's another product that I wasn't 100% sure I needed when I started growing a beard, but I've been playing around with now for the past couple of months and the difference it makes to the overall condition, shine, and softness of my beard is incredible. Video on that to come at some point soon, probably probably in this, this crowded ensuite. Oh, God, I hope it isn't too echoey in here. I'm in too deep. <laughs> Again, we'll show you how to use this one properly. But if you want to pick it up now, we'll put a little link in the description. And generally speaking, small amount in your hands, work it into your beard, grab a beard comb if you've got one, if not some hands, run it through and leave it for a couple of minutes, wash it out. Okay. Thanks for joining us again, guys. I've been Alex from Mission Beard, your one-stop shop for beard care products, tools, and tips. As we mentioned before, we're pretty new to YouTube, so if you've enjoyed this, we'd really appreciate it. If you drop us a like, if you have any questions, feel free to drop a comment and we'll get back to you. And if you want to see more from us and you want to help support us and help us keep making solid content and beard care products, then please consider following. As always, have a great day and let it grow, bro.